Alright folks, today's dish is called Hasselback Turkey. Stay tuned. It's time to grill. And as always, we're gonna get started with chopping up some veggies. You will need a zucchini or, or a courgette or whatever the name of that veggie is where you live. Just take away a little bit of the bottom and then cut it into long slices. The slices should have more or less the size of the turkey breast that you're using today. I'm experimenting a little bit with the thickness, so I cut some bigger and some smaller um, pieces or slices just to have enough to have it look really, really beautiful. If you want to recreate this dish at home, make sure to check the video description. We have a whole list of ingredients in there. Then you will need tomatoes. It's more or less the same technique. Cut away the bottom and then slices. I prepared about three of these and just played around with the sizes same than with the other veggies. Then you will need a turkey breast. This is a turkey breast and what I do is I cut out a small piece from the middle. Because stuffing, there is not much space. If you do too much stuffing in there, it's really, really horrible to get that out of the grill because uh, there is not much space or enough space for all the stuffing. That's why we are cutting away apart from the inside. Now season it with your favorite barbecue rub. We're using magic green barbecue rub, which is kind of a green magic dust. Same idea than a magic dust, but only with green ingredients. I tried to put a little bit of that barbecue rub into the uh, parts where I cut, but it's um, more or less okay. And then I start to add the veggies step by step. For your eye, it's always beautiful. It's the same with uh, if you're doing skewers. If you have the um, exact uh, um, colors for each part. So it's always green, red, green, red, green, red, green, red. This makes it look really, really good. Okay, once you're ready, in the meantime, we have already prepared the Landman Triton gas grill, 140 degrees Celsius, uh, 280 degrees Fahrenheit. And then try to get this onto the grill without any accident. Was easier than I thought. Now it's on the warming rack. Now close the lid, indirect heat. And about 45 minutes later, we have an internal temperature of 70 degrees Celsius. And this is exactly the moment where we add grated cheese. We are using grated Swiss cheese today, but of course, as always, feel free to use your favorite grated cheese. 15 minutes later, we are headed for an internal temperature of 75 degrees Celsius, which is safe from Salmonella and other bacteria. Cut and see how it looks like. You will now have the result of a colorful, tasty, juicy, cheesy turkey breast. And I can't wait to hear what you think about that. Please hit that like button, leave me a comment and subscribe. If you haven't subscribed yet, you could also visit my fan pages. You will find Oid 15 Barbecue on Facebook, on Insta, on TikTok. I'm everywhere. It tastes amazing. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'm out. See you.